may not have had quite the glitz and glamour of the Oscars, but for one night last week, the Astor in Melbourne was the centre of the movie-making universe. The venue played host to Celluloid Soup, screening for the very first time the 12 shortlisted entries in the Jewish Short Film Festival. And with four prizes up for grabs, it was a tense night for the budding directors, who had all uttered those immortal words, lights, cameras, action. All revolving around the theme kosher lovin', the films were an eclectic mix, some funny, some moving, and they tackled a number of issues, from domestic violence to marrying out to leaving home and to dating. But there could only be four winners, so who scooped the awards on the night? Well, the Open Channel Award for an Emerging Artist went to Jackie Bluestein for Love Matters, which used the laws of Kashrut as metaphors for three different kinds of relationships. Third prize was taken by Ben Cunningham for One True Love, a documentary about Jewish musical duo The Clones. Second prize on the night was scooped by Ben McGill for his haunting film The People of the Dibbuk. But the overall winner was Adrian Elton with his pastiche pop song My Girl She Isn't Kosher. My girl she isn't kosher But she tastes fine She's more like Ballinger than Carmel Wine Of course you may not agree with the celluloid suit judges. But fortunately, though the awards night may be over, one prize still remains the AJN Reader's Choice Award. To select your favourite flick from the film festival, visit jewishnews.net.au slash celluloid soup finalists, where you can watch all the movies and vote for your favourite. Zeddy Lawrence, JNTV.